Law enforcement agencies across the state, in fact, are reviewing their security measures this week to prepare for any situation. As Eric Richards reports, the departments in northeast Wisconsin are taking notice of the warnings issued by federal authorities. Just over a week ago, we all watched as our nation's capital was overrun by people who in large part contest the results of the election. The building was breached and over 100 people are currently facing federal charges. When high profile situations occur, local departments take notes. A lot of us have been revisiting uh, what our plans, our security plans are for, for local governments. Um, it's something we've been doing uh, in Appleton. We live in an era where we can no longer say this won't happen here. Departments are always on alert. It was uh, uh, eye-opening, uh, shocking, something I hope uh, we never see again in our lifetime. Green Bay police also have a strategy in place in case riots and violence happen here. As a matter of fact, it was not too long ago when they did have riots and protests within the city. The Green Bay Police Department really takes a proactive effort to learn from what others have gone through. We are reminded that police work is a collaborative effort between departments and the community. Having a lot of briefs, training and communicating our personnel what we're doing so that if someone has a better idea or if we miss something, that we come together as a team to provide the best response. All law enforcement agencies say that if you see something, say something, especially if it does not seem right. And they want the public to know that they are prepared for anything. In the Fox Cities Bureau, Eric Richards, Local 5 News. Thanks, Eric. And monthly meetings take place among law enforcement agencies that address current events and shareable information in order to respond to emergency tactical situations. Well,